Right now, you are sitting on the largest seismic simulator in Europe, capable of reproducing earthquakes up to 7 on the Richter scale. This educational simulator, the only one of its kind, was conceived and designed entirely by the School of Engineering of the University of Applied Sciences Western Switzerland Valais here in Sion. Mechanical, automotive and IT engineers worked together for several years on the development of a facility that can reproduce earth tremors by means of a system of hydraulic jacks situated below the floor. The jacks are of the same kind as those found on certain kinds of construction plant. Like our muscles, these jacks work solely in traction. If the two right-hand jacks pull, the platform will move to the right. To move the platform forwards, the two front jacks need to be actuated. This simulator moves forwards and backwards, but not up and down. Each jack can pull with a force equivalent to 2.7 tons, subjecting you to horizontal acceleration of 1 g, which corresponds to a car accelerating from 0 to 100 km an hour in 2.7 seconds. The automotive engineers have programmed a computer to coordinate the movements of these four jacks to reproduce earthquakes. Since the floor of the simulator needs to be able to move easily, it is supported by six feet mounted on an air cushion. The air pressure circulating in the tubes can lift one kilogram, but once beneath the foot, the surface is much bigger and the same pressure is then enough to lift a weight of 500 kilograms. The feet then behave like little hovercrafts floating on an air cushion. Fortunately, the simulator does not move by more than 30 centimeters, which is still a lot for such a huge platform that measures 6 meters by 5 and weighs 3 tons when the space is fully occupied. The skills that have gone into manufacturing this simulator are taught on the bachelor's degree courses offered at the School of Engineering in Sion. Our future engineers will have the task of meeting the technical and technological challenges facing our society. We hope you found this introduction to our simulator interesting and that you enjoy the rest of your visit.